Hi, perhaps this question will surprise you, but have you ever thought of managing a really big factory like this? A chemical plant, or a brewery if you prefer. A short while ago, I couldn't have imagined it. The reason being, devices like this. They are needed for temperature, pressure and level control, for instance. You say, what's the problem with that? Well, in an average factory, there are thousands of these devices and they all need to be installed and operated. That's something you can't manage from the comfort of your chair and the control center because for devices like these, you need a specific software to be installed on a certain computer somewhere in your plant. According to Murphy's Law, miles from anywhere. If you were unlucky, you had to install specific software for each of the devices and each differing significantly in terms of operation. Also, information from the devices couldn't get through to you in the control center. Not exactly brilliant, because you were going to be snowed under with work. In urgent need of a better solution, exactly my point. And that's why you see a laptop and a printer on this desk. What does this have to do with the complex control of a factory? A lot, because from now on, installing and operating a device will be as easy as installing and operating a printer on your PC. A printer communicates with a computer via a so-called driver, a tiny file which the manufacturer supplies on a CD, for instance. And as everybody knows, Installing it is a no-brainer. Simply insert and double-click. With your factory terminals and devices, it's pretty much the same. There's a new technology called FDT, which standardizes the communication interface between field devices and systems. The devices get uniform drivers called DTMs and your systems a so-called frame application for device control. All of your devices and factory terminals will be able to speak the same language. Just like printer and laptop. Therefore, FTT provides transparent data access into all system types, no matter which device type, supplier or communication protocol you have and no matter where a device is located in your plant. Put simply, gone are the days when you had to drive for miles no matter what the weather to get to a device located somewhere on the complex. Now information gets directly through to you and with much greater comfort than before, you have better access to all the data from wherever you are. <laughs> That's what I call state of the art. And now you wanna know if it's easy to implement FDT in your factory, right? Of course it is. In fact, you can compare it to a set of building ones. FDT supports more than 12 communication protocols and is also open for future standards. It is supported by more than 60 field device suppliers and 15 system suppliers worldwide. Right now, there are over 1300 DTMs available and yes, it is compatible with already existing and future automation equipment. So you can easily upgrade and manage multiple generations of devices. You have the ultimate freedom of choice because everything is available exactly for your purpose. All this guarantees to protect your investments. Let's summarize these technical facts. FDT provides a system easy to operate with a lot of benefits. We got one FDT interface, a worldwide supported open technology, more than 1300 Certified DTMs and 15 FDT frames already exist. FDT is a standard for now and the future that guarantees you protect your investments. FDT provides more data transparency and higher quality information from your plant's assets. You choose the products that exactly match your applications. 
too much information. Well, let me put it this way then. FDT fits your needs exactly and helps you save a bundle of money. And no, you're not gonna be the guinea pig for FDT testing. Mr. Frank, what can you tell us about FDT technology in your industry? We are here in the Klärwerken of the city of Nürnberg. Our anlage consists of two Klärwerken and a central analysis lab. Our anlage parts are spread over several kilometers wide. Here, in 35 meters high, we start earlier often when our devices were configured or parametrized, or when we wanted to find a failure. And the failure must be made by wind and weather. Dank FTT haben wir einen einheitlichen und zentralen Zugriff auf sämtliche Gerätedaten von all unseren FTT-Rechnern aus. Selbst die Funktionen der komplexesten Geräte können von hier aus abgerufen werden, zum Beispiel die sofortige Analyse von Störsignalen oder die Plausibilitätsprüfung von Ergebnissen. Dank dem FTT-Standard können wir uns die Geräte aussuchen, die für unsere Anwendungen am besten geeignet sind und sind somit herstellerunabhängig. Außerdem wurde durch die Rahmenapplikation der Schulungsaufwand gesenkt und Fehlbedienungen verringert, da es jetzt eine einheitliche grafische Schnittstelle gibt. Und wenn wir doch einmal hinaus müssen, nur dann, wenn ein Gerät reparaturbedürftig ist. Und selbst diese Meldungen erhalten wir über unsere zentrale Rahmenapplikation. All diese Punkte haben uns gezeigt, es ist richtig, dass wir auf die FTT-Technologie gesetzt haben und weiterhin setzen werden. Well, thank you. And I guess that's all I have to say right now. Although, have I mentioned the fact of how much more convenient it'll be to operate the devices? Whoa! Thanks for the coffee. <laughs> hmm. I mean, if you want, you can control everything from the comfort of your chair in the uh, control room. And that's why I can imagine being in charge of the devices in a large plant now. Ah, that's the life. So, what are you waiting for? 